World War II vet goes viral Ramaswamy NH Town Hall what you're saying exactly what my generation grew up, a new Fox News poll shows the political outsider placing third in the GOP primary race, a World War II veteran praised Republican presidential candidate Vivek Ramaswamy at a recent town hall in Hollis, New Hampshire, telling him his words are what his generation grew up in. In an exchange posted on social media Friday from the event on Sunday, the veteran identified as David took a moment to express gratitude towards the GOP outsider, who has made restoring national identity a hallmark of his campaign. I'd like to say that I'm a veteran of World War II, David began, sparking huge applause from the crowd and prompting Ramaswamy to shake his hand. What you're saying, the words you're saying, are exactly what my generation grew up in, David said. Children, adults stood at attention and crossed their hearts when the flag passed by in a parade. School started with a prayer and the Pledge of Allegiance. That's no longer going on. There was a loyalty and pride in America. Children were leaving school 12, 13 years old and joined the service to protect our country. It was one country. America. And I like your policies. I love to hear it because it's what I remember. Thank you very much, he continued before earning another round of applause and a standing ovation. Ramaswamy walked over again and gave him a hug, telling the veteran. Thank you for your service to this country. It means a lot. You're my hero, the veteran told the candidate. You're my hero, Ramaswamy exclaimed. Ramaswamy, a biotech entrepreneur with virtual no national name ID before entering the 2024 race, has risen in the polls and made a big splash at the first Republican primary debate last month. A new national poll released by Fox News on Thursday showed Ramaswamy placing third with 11% support among primary voters behind Florida Governor Ron DeSantis with 13% and former President Donald Trump, who is maintaining a commanding lead with a whopping 60% support. They are the only three candidates polling in double digits. When polled voters were asked who would be their second choice if Trump were not in the race. It's a dead heat between DeSantis and Ramaswamy, earning 33% and 31%, respectively. Former Vice President Mike Pence trailed with 11%, while the rest of the field earned single-digit support.